आई एग्री विद यू डेट इंग्लिश इज हार्ड इंग्लिश इज इंट्रीगिंग इंग्लिश इज डिसेप्टिव इंग्लिश इज वेरी डिफिकल्ट टू लर्न एट आई अग्री विद यू ऑल इंग्लिश लर्नर्स बट द गुड न्यूज इज डैट आई हैव कपल ऑफ सोल्यूशन विच आई एम गोइंग टू शेयर विद यू इन दिस वीडियो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल इंग्लिश सीम्स टू बी वेरी वेरी ईजी एट द बिगनिंग वाई बिकॉज वी हैव टू यूज ओनली हेल्पिंग वर्ब डिड विद आई वी दे यू वट एवर इज द सब्जेक्ट वी आर एज्यूम टू यूज द विद द अर्थ द मून द सन एंड इट सीम्स क्वाइट ईजी वी कैन लर्न इट बाय हार्ट बट वेन वी मूव टू वर्ड्स ए वन बी टू आर सी टू लेवल आर एट एडवांस लेवल वट हैपन्स डैट दैन दिस फिनोमिना आर दिस डिफिकल्टी अराइजेज वाई दिस डिफिकल्टी अराइजेज बिकॉज वी सी देर आर लॉट ऑफ एक्सेप्शंस विद एवरी रूल देर आर आर लॉट ऑफ एक्सेप्शंस and the only way to learn these exceptions is to memorize and cram them and the hardest part of english language occurs when there is a hell of difference between pronunciation and spelling first of all we will discuss why this gap has been occurred or why this gap has occurred in pronunciation and spelling because the words which you see in magazines books or in anything you cannot pronounce the same word in the same way which is written for example if i see the word knife k is silent and we just pronounce it at knife there are so many exception like comb like knowledge these are some of the exceptions and here comes the hardest thing so how to deal with this all phenomena the first thing why this change has occurred because evolution or change has been transformed in pronunciation level but spellings have been the same there is no change there is no change regarding spelling but pronunciation has evolved itself pronunciation has transformed changed itself completely with the passage of time so the thing is that i accept with you all but my first advice or my first solution is that you don't have to seek perfection for english language you have to keep this thing in your mind the learning of or uh, the purpose of learning english language the purpose of advancing in english language is just to communicate in an understandable way if you can convey your message if you can deliver your message if the other person can understand what you are speaking clearly then it means that your pronunciation is good you don't need to have perfection in english language this is the basic thing and if you make lot of mistakes if you make mistakes while speaking english language believe me native english speakers also make mistakes so don't take this heart and if you feel anxiety if you feel depression if you feel fear then believe me that if you can utilize your body language properly with your eye contact with your smile on your face you can tackle this problem easily because all these things all these problems all these hurdles and difficulties are the part and parcel of any language and these are faced by every english learner who has reached to an advanced level and the good news is that you have to do it continuously you have to do it consistently if you do it consistently like your any habit like eating drinking sleeping and if you make it as your habit and gradually you will see a transform a transformation a change in your language because all these troubles can be overcome because all these troubles all these obstacles are the obstacles of any bigger achievement and if you are facing these things it means that you are going to achieve something different you are going to achieve something higher 
when you are about to fulfill your dreams there come hurdles many obstacles but it doesn't mean that you should stop and you should sit silent no you have to overcome all these hurdles you have to be consistent you have to do your hard work you have to burn your midnight oil you have to be disciplined and no matter you want to study or not you have to study like ronaldo the biggest are the greatest legend of this football history always say that nobody wants to go to gym but i have to go to gym every single day despite the fact i do not like every day because no one likes to go to gym every day the same thing happens that if you want to carve the history if you want to mark the history or if you want to mark your name then you have to do it you have to go against your mind you have to go against your wishes and desires because our wishes our mind always see, ask us that sit in comfort zone don't do hard work it's hard for you it's tough for you you cannot achieve it's impossible for you but you have to dictate your mind that it's possible it's achievable it's easy i can do i will do i can overcome if you have these mantras every single day believe me you will see tremendous change and english which is which is now hard deceptive intriguing and very malicious you will see that it will be a friend for you to fulfill your dreams whether for the job studying abroad having a successful business trip or having a travel abroad so with this positive note if you understand this video you have to comment me at that which piece of advice you find or you found helpful if you really find this video helpful please share and like and share and subscribe this channel and hit that bell icon because it motivates me a lot to make much 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 more informative videos for you guys because nowadays i am receiving very very positive feedback and it seems that it seems that now people are encouraging the talent of a teacher and it and i highly regard and i and i thank you all of you for this positive support and positive feedback from all my english learners so stay happy stay blessed thank you so much have a nice day